Good morning, Pirates. Today is Friday, December 10th. Happy National Human Rights Day, and here are your daily announcements. But first, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I salute the flag of the state of New Mexico, the Zia symbol of perfect friendship among united cultures. Hello everyone, I'm Skylar Charlie and welcome to the Morning Show. We start with the congratulations to the following students who qualified for round two of the University of New Mexico p and Foundation Mathematic Contest. These students are Alexandra Pasamante, Jalen Cadadio, Angel Moreland, Noah Lundstrom, and Manda Butler. These students will be competing for round two on February 5th, 2022. We wish them all the best of luck. All pirates, don't forget about the challenge that Mr. Wagner has announced. Record yourself or you and your friends singing the Grand High School fight song on your TikTok account, Instagram page, or other social media outlets and share the video with us. If your clip appears on our show, Mr. Wagner has promised free pizza. That's right, free pizza. And all you have to do is sing the school fight song, record it, and share it. If you don't know the words, ask around or send us an email and we'll send them to you. Students, I know it's hard to believe, but we've only got less than a week to go before the end of the semester. And I know we're all looking forward to your break, but now's not the time to let up on the gas. Remember that if you are struggling to do well in math, science, or history, there are resources available to help you. Mr. Garcia will offer students an assistance in New Mexico and World History after school in room 203. Mr. Grosch will help you out in science in room 304 after school. Mrs. Labarito can assist you in Algebra 1 in science in room 265 before and after school. And Mr. Lauder can assist you in math, Algebra 1 and up in room 231 before school. Don't wait too long to get the help you need. We also have finals next week, so get to studying and be ready. For lunch today, we're having chili beans, tossed salad, carrot sticks, cornbread, and diced peaches. The GHS football team has begun its off-season weightlifting and speed development program. The program runs Monday through Thursday from 3.30 to 5 p.m. in the weight room. Coach Hernandez is asking students to bring running shoes, cleats, and water and be ready to work. Preseason tennis workouts are being held every Tuesday and Wednesday at 5 p.m. at the high school tennis courts. Even if you have never played tennis and think you might want to try it, now's the time to learn. If you have any questions or want to see what tennis is about, please come meet the coaches at the courts at 5 p.m. on Tuesdays or Wednesdays. To celebrate the New Mexico Year of Literacy, we have been asking students and staff to tell us about their favorite books. Let's take a look at what some of them said. In basketball news, take a look at this photo sent to us by girls' C-team coach Robert Marcus. It shows the JHS girls with their first place trophy from the Robert and Mildred Holmes tournament in Gallup. The GHS boys' C-team won their first two games, but lost to host school Mayamara in the championship game to finish in second place. Good job, guys. Students that are wanting to participate in the 39th annual Mel Taylor Winter Quadrathlon as a four-person team have the opportunity to be sponsored by local community members. Equipment can be provided to a team if needed. A team consists of a biker, runner, cross-country skier, and snowshoer. The race will take place on February 19, 2022. A special birthday shout out to Angelina Chavez, Santana Chavez, and Matthew Knott. Happy birthday. I hope you all have a fantastic day. The GHS Morning Show is brought to you by Angry Jack Productions and the students of the broadcasting classes. And as always, we are GHS for success. <laughs>